Hey Joe, check this out. I found an old IC chip with this ceramic package in that busted circuit board we picked up last weekend. Whoa, one of those vintage ceramic ones? You don't see those often anymore. Most modern chips are plastic, and they don't have nearly as much value for recovery. Exactly. Ceramic ICs are kind of the gold mine, literally. I cracked this one open and look inside. See those tiny silver wires? And look under the die. That's real gold, man. You could either see it with the naked eye. Look at that shine, pure golden yellow. That is beautiful. You know, not many people realize it, but these old ceramic IC chips are some of the best sources for gold recovery. It's not just a shiny novelty. If you collect enough of them, the gold content adds up pretty nicely. Totally. In my experience, ceramic packages give you a much higher yield compared to just scraping gold-plated pins or edge connectors. Sure, you need quite a few chips, but the payoff is worth it if you're patient. Yeah, it's almost like hidden treasure. But I guess that's why they're getting rare. People are catching on. Exactly. That's why I always keep my eye out at e-waste spots and old electronic sales. You never know what you'll find. In fact, in the next video, I'm going to try extracting the gold from this chip and show the full process step by step. Should be fun to see how much gold I actually get out of it. Ah, uh, definitely watch that. It's not just about the gold. It's about understanding the value in these old forgotten components. Plus, you're keeping waste out of the landfill. Yep, gold recycling is both rewarding and kind of addictive. So if you've got old electronics lying around, don't throw them away. There might be more value inside than you think. Right on. And hey, don't forget to hit that next video when it's up. You got it. Thanks for watching, friends. See you next time.